this laptop come in uh, Dell laptop 15.6 inch the problem with this laptop is sometimes showing data on the screen and sometimes doesn't show data on the screen I remove the CD-ROM I remove uh, hard drive and I remove keyboard also and uh, I remove battery and I check the battery it's okay this laptop sometimes work showing data sometimes doesn't show now I off now I on the laptop ah now you see it's showing data now it's showing data I off the laptop I on the laptop see it doesn't show any data and come in the sound I to test all I see in this uh, motherboard laptop motherboard model LA 9104P this is from Compal company this motherboard belong to uh, Dell laptop so as you see and this motherboard we will check every IC in this laptop and we check the voltage and we check if it's short or not short now we connect uh, AC adapter here and we will start the laptop As you see, laptop will start here. Now we'll check this first one, this IC. This IC belong to sound. This uh, belong to sound card. To this uh, laptop you can see from the data sheet this is IC have uh, two kind of power power 3.3 volt and uh, 5 volt pin number one will have 3.3 we will check using ovometer you can see here in this pin 3.3 is ok so this is the first power pin now there is another pin pin number 25 and pin number 38 it's uh, it's have 5 volt 25 number 25 is here Okay, you can see 
4.6 okay it's, that's mean uh, it's 5 volt also here and pin number 38 what is the 38 37 38 here also that is 5 volt so now this IC is 70 or 80 person is okay let's work okay now we check another one Now we have this IC, this regulator. This IC generates uh, two kind of volt, 3.3 and 5 volt. This two volt will work inside the laptop. Even if you turn off laptop, they call it three points, always 3.3 volt and always 5 volt. So we will check if there is any volt. This pin 5 volt, so that's mean okay. And from this pin 3.3 volt, so that's mean this IC okay. As I told you before, each capacitor here beside IC, this capacitor will connect with the ground and with a volt source. This capacitor will work like filter. Or voltage now this IC I will show you in the, the data sheet this IC is okay as we measure uh, the volt for example here 5 volt if you find this lower than 5 volt maybe 3 volt 2 volt or if you find uh, this 3.3 volt if you find it 1 volt 2 volt that means this IC is damaged and need to replace. Now we'll check this IC, charging IC, PU100. Uh, pin number one is coming for this pin, uh, 19 volt from AC adapter. AC, as you see here, 19 volt is okay. And it's have uh, another supply, 3.3 uh, volt from this pin. Okay. Now this is uh, BIOS flash run. It's also this IC. So, and pin one number one must be there 3.3 volt. So we will check number one. 3.3 volt is okay. So. This IC is okay. Now I suspect on BIOS chip. So I will remove this IO, uh, flash memory for BIOS and I will reprogram it. And we will see what will happen. I will program the flash memory with uh, this program or uh, this uh, BIOS memory with this programmer we will reprogram it and we will check what is the problem
Now after we reprogram the, the chip. BIOS chip. We will check the laptop again. Now we will on. Okay, it's working now. Now we will off and on two, three times. Okay. Now the third time. Okay. So the problem was with the with the program inside this uh, uh, BIOS chip. When we reprogram it on a, a new when we uh, install a new BIOS pin by by uh, we use programmer. Now it's work okay. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.